IS is said to be in full control of the ancient Syrian city of Palmyra after advancing on the site Wednesday. Officials say pro-government forces retreated following a massive assault by the militant group overnight. According to the monitoring group, the Syrian Observatory for Human Rights, 100 pro-Assad troops were killed in the deadly clashes, while IS managed to capture a nearby airbase, a prison and two gas fields. Palmyra, also known as Tadmor, has been named a UNESCO World Heritage Site for its ancient stone arches hailing from the 1st and 2nd century when it was built under Roman rule. The city is also called Venice of the Sands for its oasis features, while the fear for the safety of its precious monuments grows with each report emerging from the fighting. Syrian officials assured that necessary measures were taken to prevent destruction of antiques. The statues are now safe and secure places, but the question is how to protect the beautiful cemeteries and beautiful temples and other monuments that are present in the city. Imagine an archaeological city becomes a battlefield between criminals and the city's defenders. At the end of this, there is Syrian determination and the Syrian people will not give up Palmyra. Palmyra is considered a strategic city as it is located on the road to Damascus and near the gas fields of the city of Dir el-Zur. Its capture by IS may prove to be a crushing loss for the Syrian government, as well as a devastating blow to world history should the city be left in ruins.